everyone. Today I'm going to shoot a video on uh, gluing up some miters real quick. Uh, just a simple video, really small frame that I'm gluing up here for a small painting I'm going to do. And I figured I'd shoot a quick video. <clears throat> so the first thing I do is I get myself a nice flat surface here. It's uh, just the back of a canvas actually. And I got my miters here. Just to, uh, you can see my frame, I cut up pieces. I didn't even uh, sand anything on the other side. First thing I'm going to do, you just want to make sure that they're going to line up nice and tight before you even put any glue in okay so you see there that's my fit just uh chopped them on a miter saw a while ago and uh, i got them like that <clears throat> okay so i'm going to set them up like this i've just got uh some glue in a bottle here it's one of the bottles i use this is just tight bond glue so i'm going to glue up the edges here put some glue on each each one i'm actually just going to use my finger to spread it Usually I will use a, uh, a glue brush, but this is a quick one, so I could just use my finger here. Make sure the glue is spread out nice on all the pieces. And we're going to repeat this for all four pieces. Make sure you got a nice glue surface there. There's two pieces, two more to go. Now, if this was a bigger frame and I needed a little more workable time here, I'd be doing this setup a little bit differently, but for this, we're pretty good. One more to go. Here we go. We got our glue on everything. Nice glue spread there. Okay, so there's that. I'm gonna move my glue bottle out of the way. I'm just gonna lay all four of these pieces down. And I'm just gonna bring them together as tight as I can on their own. And we're gonna clamp this up here in a second anyway, but just wanna make sure we start off on the right track. Okay, so now something this small, this is about four by four. Um, just got some six inch clamps here that we're going to use. So you see how I set this up here. I'm just going to get them close. So I'm barely touching at that point. Let me get the other side set up here. This is how I glue up most of my frames. Okay, barely touching. I'm going to set the other two up crossway here. Have these standing vertical. Again, just a little bit of pressure, just enough to stand them up. Keep them tight in there. Okay, now I can start going a little tighter. So now you just want to get pretty close. You're going to see a little bit of glue squeeze out as I tighten these up a little bit. Um, if you notice here, I kept my clamps in from the edges here okay all four of them are in from the edges i want to leave the edges open because they're going to move a little bit and i'm just looking to see where i need to tighten up this one's sticking out a little bit so i'm going to tighten up here just a little bit and i'm just going to kind of go around here tighten each one up just a little bit you don't need to over clamp just a nice hand tight grip will do just fine there's that. Just want to make sure I get a little bit more on this guy and this guy, so I can get a little more grip. Here's those. Here's this one. Um, I don't know if you can see, but I got a little bit of glue squeeze out here. Bring it a little closer for you. See, you just got that little bit of glue squeeze out on those. That's a pretty solid glue surface there. It's nice and flat. Um, with a bigger frame, what I would normally do is I'd put clamps here on the edges as well to keep everything flat. But that's some really nice, simple one by pine that stays nice and flat. So there's our glue up. Uh, leave it like that for at least a half hour. Don't stress the joint for 24 hours. I'll leave it like this till tomorrow though. And then I'll sand, stain it, and I'll route out the inside so I can have a little inlay there, a little rabbit so I can put my frame in there. And uh, that's pretty much it, man. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.